Hey everybody, in today's video, I'm gonna be walking you through how to take a manual recording of your altitude value using your Casio ProTrek PRG270 watch. So this watch actually has three different ways it stores your uh, maximum and minimum altitude values. I'm gonna try and explain them as quick as I can and then we'll jump into the manual ones. You've got automatic saving, which basically means when I go into my altimeter, I'm gonna press the bottom left, uh, sorry, bottom right button and we're gonna go into the altimeter mode. While you're in this mode, your watch will automatically save any high and low altitude values. That's called auto save. Now, the minute I get out of my altimeter, I'm gonna go ahead and press the mode button to get out of it. It stops doing an auto save. It quits automatically looking for altitude change, uh, mix, maximums and minimums. You've got another option, which is trek mode. Trek mode basically means I'm gonna go into my altimeter, I'm gonna tell the watch that I'm doing a trek, even if I get out of my altimeter, if I'm in trek mode, it will continue to record my high and low values because I'm doing a trek. The other option that you've got is manual, and that's what we're gonna be doing right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna press the altimeter button. Let's go into our altimeter. Now, remember, it's automatically recording our maximum and minimum values, but what if you just wanted to manually record your altitude of where you are. Maybe you're on top of a mountain, maybe you're at your deer stand and you wanna know what the altitude value is there. While you're in the altimeter mode, we are going to press and hold the ALTI, the bottom right button on the watch. The trick here is you don't wanna press it too long. If you press it too long, it will put you into trek mode. To do a manual recording, we're gonna press it long enough to where we see REC displayed on the screen. Once we see that, we know it's taken our manual recording and we're gonna let go of this button. So let's take note of my time. It's 12.18 p.m. and my altitude reading is 115 feet. I'm gonna go ahead and do a manual recording. I'm gonna press and hold. I see REC, I let go. We should have successfully recorded our altitude reading. So let's go check that now. I'm gonna go ahead and press the mode button. We're gonna get out of our altimeter. Now we need to go look at our recordings. I'm gonna press the mode button two times till we get to the REC screen, and then we can see our recordings here. It's always gonna put you on the first recording. If you wanna go through and look at your manual recordings, all you're going to do is press the ALTI or compass button. ALTI will move you forward, compass will move you backwards. If I press the compass button, it takes me to my last one, which was number seven. It shows you the date. Today's date is January 27th, 12.18 is the time I took the recording, and that was the value that was recorded. I can use the ALTI button or the compass button to go look at any manual recordings that have been done. You can hold up to 30 manual recordings on the watch. You can see in my case, I've only got seven of them that have been recorded, so the seventh one is my last value and that's the one that we just took. Once you're done looking at your recordings, you simply press the mode button. I've done a video in the past that shows you how you can clear out your recordings and you can also save so that one of your recordings doesn't get overwritten. If you exceed 30, basically it starts overriding the earliest ones that you have in there and you have a way to lock those so that it doesn't get uh, overwritten. Anyway, that's how you do a manual recording of your altitude on your Casio ProTrek PRG270 watch. I hope the video helps. 